Hey Brews and welcome back to my vlog channel, Annalisa's Glam Live. So, today uh, has been a stressful day for me because this morning I went Christmas shopping and I vlogged it all, but unfortunately my SD card decided it didn't want to uh, didn't want to be a part of that and deleted most of the footage, so I switched to my iPhone and filmed on that. So, I do have some of what I filmed from Christmas shopping today, so I'll be able to share that with you guys. But I was able to get a majority of the presents for my family this year which is really good. I'm glad that's all over with because the shops were so insanely busy. So let's cut to that footage of me Christmas shopping this morning. I'm at the Bauble Place because the ones that we have for our Christmas recently smashed. So these are all the ones that I am looking at to get personalized. Be beautiful for my Nana in loving memory of, but I think that's a bit sad. Right, these are the three that I have chosen. One for me, one for my mom, and one for my Nana. But can someone buy this for me? This is the cutest ever. Or even this one, a koala mug, how cute. This is so cute. They have my size. And no, of course not. Well, there goes that. All right, the pet toys. I need something for Charlie because he won't stop scratching my couch. So maybe something like this that he can play with would be perfect. And only four bucks. What a cheap present. All right, in the end, this is what I bought. I got my cat, the toy that you guys all saw. I also got this Jamie Oliver vegetarian book, uh, like cookbook. The person that I'm giving this to isn't vegetarian, but they always make me watch the Jamie Oliver vegetarian show. So now they can have this book, so we don't have to watch that show anymore. For my pop, I got him this neck and shoulder massager because I didn't know what to get my pop. He's 85 years old, but I Googled it and apparently this is something he would like. And for my stepdad, I've already bought him something else, but I also got him his favorite chocolates, which are also my favorite chocolates that I really want to eat. But I'm not going to, I'm gonna wrap them up now, that way I won't. So I've just spent in the afternoon trying to recover the lost footage and it unfortunately isn't gonna happen and then I have been wrapping my Christmas presents so these are them all under the tree my beautiful tree and now it's looking a little more full so I am now waiting for my friend Rucha to come over because she is going to have a sleepover tonight we're gonna have a lot of like Christmassy treats lots of yum stuff that I'm really looking forward to so this is gonna be a lot of fun so I will check in with you guys when Rucha gets here so my friend Rucha just got here this is Rucha and Hello. we are making some pizzas so I'll show you guys <laughs> so embarrassing well not embarrassing but so Rucha went out and bought all the food and we are making pizzas so this is Rucha's pizza base you know normal size that's my hand for comparison Rucha couldn't find any gluten-free pizza bases and I was like oh totally fine like I'll find them myself they're over here and I couldn't find any gluten-free pizza bases either I don't know what's going on but this is what I'm using a tortilla look at the size difference between them it's mad <laughs> But we've also been baking as well. We have some rum balls in the fridge ready to go. And best of all, we are making candy cane vodka. So this is literally candy cane. Oh, that they're, they're almost done. Oh my god. Pretty much. Ooh. Yeah, so we're making candy cane vodka. It's literally vodka and candy cane. And that is our night, and we're gonna watch a horror movie because somebody here oh is a big god. horror fan. Yes. <laughs> So we're gonna make the pizzas and I am starving. Are you hungry? I'm so hungry. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> and this is Rich's delicious completed pizza. And this is the gluten-free version. It doesn't look as good at all. This is what the candy cane vodka looks like now. We have just poured some with some lemonade. It's so pretty and pink and very in my aesthetic accidentally. Looks like pink lemonade. Let's give it a go. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. 
That's really strong light candy canes. Yeah, yeah it's toothpaste. really nice. Not it, in a bad it, way. Yeah, no, it's really nice. Mm, it's good. Good. good morning, everybody. It is the next day now. Richa has just left and I don't have any makeup on because I kind of like to have makeup free days since I wear so much of it. I try to at least have one day a week where I give my skin a break. But I wanted to also show you guys something cool that I bought yesterday. Well, cool isn't the right word. Weird that I bought yesterday when I was doing my Christmas shopping. And this is the item. I know it looks so weird. You can be, you might be able to tell what it's for with the fur on it. It's for my cat to get all of the excess fur off him because lately he's been having a lot of hairballs. So when I saw this, I thought it looked off. I thought it was super weird, but it would be interesting to try to see how he goes. So I tried it yesterday, but then the footage got deleted. So I thought I would try it again today because, you know, uh, he could do it with a brush. He definitely could. But my cat is so super fussy you cannot touch him on his back or he'll attack you you have to pat him just the right way but i'm gonna be patting him on his back because you know i'm trying to get the fur off so i thought i would film it and see what happens hi charlie can i pat you hmm do you want to smell it hey can i oh oh okay all right <laughs> quick i'll be quick i'll be quick cat <laughs> No, let me. Oh, ah, Charlie. <laughs> really? Really? He's being really good. I'm so surprised. Right, let's see how much fur we got off him. Ugh, yuck. That would have been all over my house, Charlie. Look at it all. No, okay. Well, that would have been all over my house, so I'm glad that I got it. That. So with that, that is going to be the end of today's vlog. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to subscribe because my next video is going to be about the best and worst purchases I made in 2019. So I think you guys will be into that. So be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you get notified next time I upload. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next vlog. Bye from me and this super furry hand. <laughs>